So what we're looking at here is a particular type of uh, ultraviolet light um, that's generated by a particular type of ultraviolet lamp. And the ultraviolet lamp is called an eczema lamp. And this eczema lamp produces ultraviolet radiation of one particular wavelength, and that's uh, about 207 nanometers. And what's special about this particular wavelength is that uh, while it kills bacteria very efficiently, uh, it is very, very strongly absorbed in biological materials. So it can't penetrate through the very surface layers of our skin, the dead cells on the surface layer of our skin. Can't penetrate even through a single human cell. So it's pretty safe, or we believe it's entirely safe, for uh, human exposure. And yet it is uh, lethal for uh, bacteria like MRSA. And the particular uh, thing that makes us very excited is that it kills drug-resistant bacteria like MRSA just as well as it kills uh, drug-sensitive uh, bacteria. And as, as you know, the problem that we have with, uh, with uh, surgical site infections is drug-resistant bacteria, uh, bacteria that don't get killed by conventional antibiotics. So we see this system uh, as having a great deal of potential in the operating room. The idea being that it would be shone on, the, the light would be shone onto the uh, wound during the surgery so that any bacteria that settle on the wound would immediately be killed. On the other hand, it would remain safe for both the, uh, the patient and also for the surgical staff because it doesn't damage human cells.